I am Anil Kumar sharing with you an excellent question on linear systems. The question is the linear system 6x plus 5y equals to 10 and ax plus 2y equals to b has infinite number of solutions. Determine a and b. You can always pause the video, answer the question and then look into my suggestions. So we are given two equations 6x plus 5y equals to 10 and the other one is ax plus 2y equals to b. So two linear equations form a linear system. We want infinite number of solutions. Now what does that mean? If you're looking for infinite number of solutions that means both equations should be equivalent equations right so so that means infinite solutions number of solutions means both equations should be exactly same or if we multiply one by the by some constant we should get the other number right so that means uh, same slope and same y-intercept. These two things specifically should be same, right? Okay, so we are looking for these two things to be same. Now one way is we can always write them in the form of slope and intercept, compare them. The other way is we could find a number so that if I multiply one equation by that number, I get the other equation, right? That's, that's another way of doing it. So I'll adopt method number two in this particular case. Now what you observe here is that we have to find A and B. So directly we cannot compare X and the constant values, but we can compare the Y values, correct? Now in order to make the, them same, what we can do is we can multiply the first equation by two, we can do times two, and the second equation by 5 times 5. This is not x, this is times 5. If we do that, we get 10y for both. And then comparing the others, we'll get the value of a and b, right? So that is the strategy. So if I multiply the first equation by 2, what do I get? I get 12x plus 10y equals to 20, right? So this is what I get when I multiply this equation by 2, right? Now if I multiply this equation by 5, then what do I get? I get ax, 5, 5ax, right? We are multiplying by 5. 5ax plus 10y equals to 5b, right? Now if I know that they are exactly same equations at this stage, only then they will give infinite solution, we can compare. So by comparing x values, we can say that 5ax equals to 12x and the constants, we can say 20 is equals to 5b, right? So from here we can solve for a. a equals to 12x divided by 5x, correct? So that gives you the value of a as 12 over 5. And here we can divide by 5, so we get 20 over 5 equals to b, or b equals to 4, right? So now we get our answer that if this system has to form infinite number of solutions, in that case, a is equals to 12 over 5, and b is equals to Four, right so that is how you could actually solve it i hope you understand and appreciate it thank you and all the best